glutes not growing? You clicked on this video for a reason, so let's get into why your glutes actually aren't growing. Hey YouTube, what's up? Welcome back to my channel. It's your trainer Remy here. On my channel, we deck all things fitness education, workout tips, glute growth, muscle growth, and so much more. The number one most likely reason that your glutes are not growing is that you're not eating enough protein. Protein is essential for muscle repair after a workout. So when you're working out and tearing that muscle, if you're not helping to rebuild that muscle by having enough protein and fueling yourself with other macronutrients, your glutes aren't going to grow at the rate they would if you were to do so. The number two reason is that you're either overtraining or undertraining. A lot of beginners will train their glutes every day thinking that the more you train the more it will grow. Muscles need time to recover. You could also be under training. If you're training your glutes once every two weeks, that's too little amount of volume in order to see consistent growth. You want to train your glutes roughly two to three times a week. The third reason is that you may be doing ineffective exercises. There's a huge variety of glute exercises, but certain exercises are better to achieve the goal of hypertrophy. If you don't know, hypertrophy means working towards building size. If you're doing constantly donkey kicks, body weight, fire hydrants, and you're not incorporating any compound lifts, your glutes aren't going to grow at the same rate they would as if you were doing these compound lifts. And the last reason your glutes might not be growing is because you might not be working in the proper set and rep range. To summarize, sets and reps are used to target specific goals. So if you're working towards building hypertrophy, like I mentioned, you're going to be working around the range of four to six sets of eight to 12 reps. If you're pushing to hit PRs, then you're probably going to be doing really high weight and low reps. If you're working in an endurance range, you're going to be doing low weight, high reps. That's it for today's video. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you like this video, be sure to give it a big thumbs up. Drop in the comments what video you want to see from me next. Check me out on all my other social medias. They will be linked down below. Make sure you subscribe if you haven't already. I'll talk to you guys in a couple days in my next video. Bye, fam.